Hello everyone, I'm Monkey Fighters of the Super Monkey Fighters, and today we're going to be reacting to EXE Killer, or XA Killer, or perhaps just X Killer, but I know nothing of this game other than I it guess it's a Western style game, so let's jump into it. You're flying in a Mandalorian. What or a. Uh, I think it's Mandalorian. Citrola! Is it a Mandalorian from Back to the Future? I can't remember. An abandoned gas station. Yes. Slick back that hat. After playing Deathloop, the kick mechanic will always be a fascinating concept in video games. Oh, picking up a three month old candy bar. Probably longer. You don't know where that's been. You don't know what's happened to that. We watch because we care. Is that the future that we're going to be ending up in? Where all we do is see everyone doing everything and we have no privacy left? Well, something just happened. Electrical sparks. Sounds like a guy just died. There's a dead body, so I guess a guy did just die. And you're robbing his body. You're such an upstanding citizen. What the hell is going on here? What the hell is going on here? Free alpha footage. Huh? From what it seems like, this game's releasing in 2025, so... It's a little ways away from that, hopefully. They refined their gaming details, game design, things like that. So I guess it's a futuristic robotic world, and I kind of like that idea of using your surroundings as a fighting mechanic. This is for your own good. This is for your own good. We're here to help you. This doesn't seem like an iRobot situation at all. And you have a... You have, like, magical abilities that allow you to just dash somewhere? Hmm. I wonder if there's... other abilities you get... beyond just, like, a short teleportation mechanic. And look at that. You got your Citrola. Pure fruit drink. It's like those old Pepsi commercials where you have a beautiful woman who's drinking a Pepsi and... Or is it a Coke? They're so similar. And also, it's kind of nice that you can call your vehicle wherever you are, allowing it, was it worth easy it? transportation. Of course that way, was. you're not running around trying to get back to your vehicle, or just running around exploring the area. Hmm. Final thoughts on the game. There's not a lot that I know about it, and there's not a lot that was even explained in the gameplay trailer. I guess you are someone who's fighting robots in a futuristic world, but 
Beyond that, there's not a lot that gets explained. There are some mechanics that I do like. I'm one who likes to use the environment to effectively take out enemies. So the fact that you were able to kick, I guess, like the radiator or battery or whatever it was to take down a robot, that was kind of a nice little thing that you can do. As well as the abilities that you get, I guess, with the short transportation, where you did the dash, whatever it was, that's kind of nice. It allows you to evade enemies that are coming at you. Given that there's not a lot that I know about this game and not a lot that was explained in this trailer, I'm kind of going to leave it here. It's going to be an interesting game to see where they go from this point now that I'm recording this video to when they actually release it, considering it's about, we'll say, two years away. Until then, if you guys are liking this kind of content from us, the gameplay reactions, or if there's any kind of new content you want us to s want to see us do, just let us know. And as always, like, comment, and subscribe on these videos because we do read your comments and it's a way for us to communicate back with you on your thoughts as well as on our thoughts. And until next time, see you later.